going on guys? It's David here. Welcome to another devotional Saturday. So I can't believe it's already been a week since my birthday. Uh, you look back and realize how fast time goes. And even though this is not the devotional is about, there's a lot of things in scripture that talks about uh, not looking back, uh, not looking back at our lives, not looking back, um, you know, like Jesus says, you know, those who put the hand to the plow and look back aren't fit for the kingdom of God. And uh, even scripture warns about uh, looking back and just saying, oh, those were the good old days and that's dangerous. And I, I think about that, like, it, it is really, because you think about how, you know, you're, you're a kid and you start looking back, oh, I wish I was a kid again and now I'm an adult, which is kind of scary to think about. And it's like, wow, time's flying. But we shouldn't be thinking back on the past. We should always be looking forward, um, especially to God's kingdom. Uh, so that's what we really need to be thinking about. And it's interesting that I thought about this. Kind of leads into today's devotional, but maybe we'll talk more on uh, looking, uh, not looking back uh, in a future video. So we'll see. But uh, today's devotional is brought to you by uh, the words of Jesus uh, that he talks about, especially with everything that's going on in the news. You hear about Russia and Ukraine and uh, train derailments in Ohio and, and just all these things going on and these plants, chemical plants exploding, just, just a lot going on. Uh, earthquakes, you know, Turkey, uh, with everything going on there. There's just so much going on, guys. And uh, just wanted to share these words with you from Jesus about everything that's going on. And one of the things Jesus says is, he says, You will hear of wars and rumors of wars, but see to it that you are not alarmed. Such things must happen, but the end is still to come. Nation will rise against nation and kingdom against kingdom. There will be famines and earthquakes in various places. All these are the beginning of birth pains. And you look around, it's happening. Uh, but we're not to be alarmed. You know, we got to keep our focus on the Lord. As Jesus tells us, uh, not to worry. Don't worry about tomorrow. Tomorrow's got enough troubles of its own. You know, seek first God's kingdom. So everything we do, we should be looking to God's kingdom. So keep your focus on him. Jesus says in uh, Luke, he talks about those who try to keep their lives are going to lose it. But those who are willing to give up their lives for him will find it. So that's what I want you guys to think about as you go about your week. And when you hear the news, me, I'm not, you know, I hear the things online. I really don't watch much TV. Uh, it's probably best to just stay away from a lot of that. Yeah, you want to know what's going on in the world, but it could get depressing. Uh, but keep your guys focus on the Lord, okay? Don't worry about it. 2,000 years ago, Jesus spoke these words. He knew what was going to happen. Uh, things are happening. Uh, so keep your focus on him. So I want you just to encourage you in that, especially if you were a believer and a follower of Jesus. Be encouraged, guys, of what's going on. Uh, keep your focus on him. If you ever need to reach out to me, reach out to me. Comment below. Uh, my contact information is in the info. Reach out to me. Love to pray for you. And I will continue to be praying for you guys as you guys are watching the video. Uh, but also, if you're an unbeliever and you're worried about everything going on, I challenge you, uh, pick up your Bible get a Bible. If you don't have a Bible, reach out to me. I will send you a Bible. Uh, but get into it. Jesus's words are truth. Um, and there's comfort. There is comfort in here that the world cannot offer you. Okay. And there's just peace like never before. Okay. So reach out to Jesus. Seek him with all your might. Repent of your sins, guys. Uh, the time is near. Maybe it will happen in our lifetime. Maybe it won't. We don't know when the world's going to come to an end. Uh, but uh, we have uh, an amazing God who's out looking out for us. So keep your focus on that as you go about your week. No matter what troubles come your way, he's got you. All right. So that's all I got for you till, um, this time. Till next time, I love you. Peace. I'm out.